when you get to this point, you're like happy to be done, but also terrified of what's coming next. I think we spend so much of our time getting to the end and then when you get there, you're like not really mentally prepared for such a journey, but it's also exciting too. It hasn't set in yet. I don't think it will set in until my name is called at the ceremony and I'm like, oh my gosh, wait, I actually am graduating. This is crazy. It's been a great four years and I know that at this point, my time in undergrad has kind of come to an end. I'm a little sad about it, a little nostalgic, but it's an exciting time to kind of look forward and see what's coming up in life. I came to college when I was 17. That's pretty young. There's a lot of growth that happens between 17 and 21. Um, but I've been able to really discover who I am as a person and I thank WB for giving me the opportunity to do that. I do feel immensely proud. I think some people believe that the degree is just a piece of paper and it's so much more than that to me um, because I have a huge legacy riding behind my degree. Um, every woman on my mom's side of the family has gotten a diploma. Every woman on my dad's side of the family has gotten a diploma. So this is a massive sense of pride for me. Well, I'm a first-generation college student, but my family's been in West Virginia since before there was a West Virginia. And it's really important to me to give back to the state that put so much into my upbringing. I wouldn't be here where I am today without really wonderful mentors, students ahead of me in the curriculum at WVU, and mentors who believed in me since day one and are now my, like my family. And I think just having those advisors, having those professors that really take time to get to know you, give you opportunities, and help you find what you really care about has put me on my path of life. Like, it's just one that I never saw coming, but I'm super grateful. And it's nice to like wake up every day and be like doing something you're passionate about. Life will not always be fair, but life can always be good. And your hopeful spirit will accompany you wherever you go and inspire you past every obstacle. You cannot take away the spirit of anyone at this school, and I think it's unmatched, and I'm gonna have a hard time finding that somewhere else, but I'm gonna take that with me wherever I go. I am from Long Island in a city and a suburb, so I did not think I was gonna like the grass and the mountains, because this is more than I've ever seen in my entire life, and so I'm definitely gonna miss the views. And just the people, everyone here has been nothing but kind. Um, so it's really exciting to be a part, and definitely gonna miss that vibe. There will never be another place like this for me. There will never be a place that provided the same insight and the same care and thoughtfulness to me in the span of four years. I'm excited to be able to take my skills and my knowledge to other places and put it to good use for people that need it. But I'm always gonna have my heart here and this is always gonna be my home. I'll miss the people. I adore everybody here and I adore the way everyone thinks and how open-minded everyone is. and and how comforting everyone is, and it just feels like home, and I'll miss that for sure.